Alright, so boom, I was sitting here pondering to myself about the gratitude I have for the 21st century in which I can converse with the harlot through sexting and no longer have to go through the days of phone sex. However, I began to think, why don't we pontificate back and forth? Although I'm going to be speaking to you, you obviously not going to be speaking to me until after the video is posted. So right now I'm really talking to myself on the camera. But nonetheless, I thought to myself, what about back in the days when you didn't have the access to sext on the phone? How did you do the nasty audio? You know through your mouth back then or you could do it through photos because I know they had a uh, of sending the news But if you didn't have access to a text message to send the news what you had to do by email But before the email right so let's, let's just say before the computers how'd you send it to people? Did you have to do like a Polaroid shot and send it to them? Hmm, how did you send news? Did you send it via? Mail you wrote a letter along with a nude to get the other party in the mood if you were in a long-distance relationship What about before that before you even were able to take photos and the Polaroids and stuff? Did you have to use etch sketches in order to send news? Hmm. What about carrier pigeon? Let's just say you sent the nude via carrier pigeon What if you had to tell them to imagine but there was no phone back in the 1800s, right? So you had to send a letter Hmm, let's go back to the caveman days or even the Egyptian days. Did you do hieroglyphics on the damn walls in order to send new? Hmm, because I would assume when the mail started, let's go back into the future around like the 1900s, you could send postcards of nudes. But what if it get lost in the mail? Somebody else see your new? Hmm, how'd they send nudes back then? Hmm. Oh, what's on? Nancy! Nancy! Yes, mama! What?